Hi, I'm Kathy from Arch Projects for Kids. Today I've created a new craft video to show you how to make an easel from popsicle sticks. The canvas sits on them right here. And they are just too cute and easy to make. Let me show you how. Before we get started, let me show you how cute an assortment of these easels look. This group is holding little canvases that are two and three quarters inches by three and a half inches, but a larger size would work just fine too. And best of all, no hot glue needed here at all. The only supplies you need are wood craft sticks, nine for each easel, mini craft sticks, one for each easel, craft glue, a pencil, ruler, and a good pair of scissors. The easel legs are made from three overlapping pairs of regular size craft sticks. To begin, mark a one and three quarter inch length on three of them with a pencil. Add a line of craft glue on the longer side of each stick. And place a stick on top of the glue as shown. Press and let dry for about 10 minutes or until they stay firmly in place. Arrange two of these sticks as shown here. A mini craft stick is going to go across the top. Add glue and attach so they overlap a bit. Press and let dry until they are firm and do not wiggle at all. When the sticks are stable, turn the frame over. Add glue just below the overlap. And place the craft stick across. It should slide right up to the edge of the overlapping stick. To make the ledge that the canvas sits on, add two more dots of glue. Place a stick on its side and press into place. Let dry for a few minutes or until it feels really firm. Next comes the stick that goes in the center of the frame. Add a dot of glue on the top, slide a stick into place, and let it dry for a few minutes too. To make a good attachment of the back stick to the easel, the rounded end needs to be cut off. It may take several cuts and rotations to make this happen, but have an adult help you if you're having trouble. Turn the easel with the back side up and add a generous dot of glue on that center stick. The easel and stick now need to be propped up against each other while they dry. A bumpy surface like a napkin works great to keep them from sliding apart. Let the easel dry for several hours or until the joints feel really firm when you pick it up. This one is ready to go and looks great with either a horizontal or vertical work of art on it. Not sure what to do with these mini easels? Well, how about something like this? Or even this? Please go and subscribe to my channel so you can see these little painting videos as soon as they are ready.